What's up everyone, I'm Kimmy. Meet Shovely Joe. He's a Nord beggar that becomes the Dragonborn with his trusty shovel at his side. Follow the series as Joe takes on the challenge of defeating Alduin the World Leader, with only his shovel to aid him in battle. Enjoy! What's up guys, it's Kimmick. We are back playing our favorite game, Skyrim. Last time we played, we had just fought Alduin up here on the mountain, or the Throat of the World, and I have talked to Parthenax just to get that dialogue out of the way, and he said we need to go and talk to the Jarl of Whiterun in order to trap a dragon inside of Dragon's Reach. So we are going to make our way there. Alright, so we've made it back to Whiterun, and now we are going to be heading into what is called Dragon's Reach to talk to Jarl Balgriff. Hopefully, we can convince him to let us trap a dragon inside Dragon's Reach, which you always can. Um, I do know it's kind of a difficult mission, though, because we will probably die once or twice, but more than likely it's just from doing something stupid. All the way up here. Got a long note. Ah, oh, crap. Okay. Um, <laughs> I fell. I fell. Shovely Joe, he fell. No, not the show. Speaking of, there it is. His magic shovel is uh, enchanted with paralyzing. It doesn't. Uh, it doesn't do very good. Because they're only damaged for one second. But you know, could be way, way worse. Uh, I'm sure if I try to enchant another shovel. I'll just put fire damage on it. This way I can actually do some damage. Let's talk to Yarl Bulgriff real quick. Did you May the gods watch over your battle. Uh, need to trap a dragon. I must have misheard you. I thought you asked me to help. I'm sorry, but I can't do it. We'll just have to keep fighting the dragon. What, do you, you want me to let the dragon into the heart of... Yes, it's the only way. another way. All doing. The world eater himself. I don't know about such things. It is Shovely Joe's destiny to destroy Alduin. That's good enough for me. Now what's this nonsense about... I want to help you... Oh, Come on. No. I can't risk... But getting... If the Greybeards were willing to host... I, Dragonborn... Maybe... Okay, well, we have to go and talk to the Greybeards about setting up a truce. So, up to... Or I guess back to the third of the world. All right. Well, we're back here at the third of the world, but I yeah. Okay. Uh. No, you're not who I need to talk to. That's weird. Oh, it's gone. Wow. Okay. Why is it gone? He must have been up in the tower. Okay, okay. Easy fixes. Easy fixes. I'll talk to Arnir. All right, so now we gotta go talk to Jarl Ulfric over here in Windhelm. Which I'm honestly surprised I haven't been to Windhelm yet. Get there. And then we will talk to Jarl Bulgriff. Not Jarl Bulgriff, I'm sorry. Jarl Ulfric. And let him know that there is gonna be a treaty or a uh, truce set up for. Capturing a dragon this way, I can kill Alduin. Alright, so here we are at Jarl Ulfric Stormcloak. I believe we've already met. Uh, destined for the chopping block, if I'm not mistaken. A fair point. I'm always looking. Seems we're... So long yeah. as your criminal past stays in the past. It will. And you don't worry. For me with honor and integrity. Yeah, I don't you care about ranks. that. Speak with up, Darmar. It's about time they turned their gaze from the heavens back to our bleeding homeland. <laughs> I want to negotiate a truce, so we will get through all this dialogue real quick, and then I will head over to Solitude and talk to General Tullius. Alright, so we've gotten Yar Ulfric to agree to the truce. Now we just gotta head over to Solitude and talk to General Tullius. All right, so we're in Castle Dower, and we are about to talk to General Tolius. We'll skip the dialogue this way. It's all a little quicker. All right, so we got General Tolius to come. Awesome. They're very loud. Okay, so we have to go and talk to Arnir again. He's up at the throat of the world. Uh, 
And then we will set up the Peace Council, which I'm going to skip all of that just because it's very, very long and very, very, very political, which I actually enjoy. But I know it'll get real boring just hearing a bunch of people talk. So once the Peace Council comes up and all of that, we'll... Oh. Texture issues. All right. That's weird. Huh. Oh, here come, uh, two people. That's weird. I've never seen that. Okay. Go back into High Rothgar. Okay. And we're going to talk to Arnir. Okay. So we are on our way to sit down at the council table whenever I figure out how the heck to get there. Uh, no. Oh, it might take me a minute to figure out how we get over there. Alright, here we are at the War Council, Peace Council. This is going to be really, really interesting. Take a seat. Let's get down to it. We Alright, so we are in the middle of the council. And there is a lot going on. Well, my game crashed, so I had to go back to an old save. Oddly enough, so we will redo this. Alright, so, Jarl Ulfric here told Tolius that he wants Markarth. And I mentioned possibly giving up Riften as a good trade. So, he wasn't very happy about that. Alright, so I'm pretty sure the council is over. They have given up two territories for all of Riften, which is a massive, massive territory and exposes the uh, Stormcloak's southern flank, which is a pretty big deal if you look at the map of Skyrim. So yeah, uh, there's a lot that goes into this. If those of you who haven't watched the entire War Council, uh, there's episodes of it and there's parts of it on YouTube. Make sure to look it up if you're interested. Alright, so I took a second to talk to Esburn here, and he wants me to kill Parthenax, which we will not be doing. While you were arranging uh, yeah. Alright, so the War Council is over, and now we are going to head over to Dragon's Reach to trap the dragon. And that is going to be a fun thing all in itself, because it takes a while. Right. Say the word. Ready to spring the trap, buddy? As I promised. My men stand ready. I'm ready, let's go. what to do. Make sure you do your Need to go to the Great Porch. See if we can get any extra gold. Might as well, right? Alright, let's see. So, yeah, this is the area and the only area we have to battle this thing. Uh, we have to go and equip the right shout. All dragon. There it is. Oh, Davin. Oh, Davin. And no matter what you do, you can try to push this guy out of the way. He still, uh, he still always gets eaten. So, now we're just waiting on the dragon. All right, it's here. Now we need to get, uh, Dragon Rind. So we can kill, or not really kill, but get this thing to land in here. Come on. Yeah. What? I thought he flew in here. He's about to. Come on. Who's shooting lightning at me? Come on, Otavim. Let's go. Do it. Heck yeah, alright. That wasn't too bad. We did it pretty well, I feel. Nice. Nice. So now we need to uh, talk to this lovely little creature here. Not like a bear in a trap. Indeed, indeed. A deal of trouble to put me in this humiliating position. Huh? Sorry, dude. In Sir Alduin. Hmm? Yeah. No doubt you want to know where to find Alduin. That is the case. So we're going to talk to this guy. He will when agree to let us ride him up to. A certain mountain where we're going to be battling, I think, four or five dragons and a lot of driver. 
Okay, so we have agreed to free the dragon, let him out, and then he's gonna fly us up to Skull Dolphin. So we need to open the trap. Sure about that. You want yes. to let that dragon loose after all the trouble? Your funeral. Someone else is gonna have to help you get him back in there again. Get That's ready. fine, it wasn't a big deal. Purely in the interest of the advancement of knowledge. This seems like a really so, we're about to let him out, and then we will ride him up to Skull Dolphin. So that's going to be kind of cool, actually. And this is one of the only times you can really ride the dragon. Um, although, after the Dragonborn DLC, you can ride a dragon a lot more. Let's talk to Odaving. Hey, hey, stop moving. Are you ready to see the world as only a Dover can? Does. Ah, that's one word off. Are you ready to yes. see the world as only a Dover yes, I am. I am ready, ready, ready. I just... What do I do? Are you ready to I am. Just get your... Yeah, get your ass out here. Come on. Okay, so it seems to be glitching. We'll see if I can figure that out. Um... I'm not really sure what happened, but we're going to have to reload that save. Yeah, had to reload the save, so we'll do this one more time, and I'll skip all of that action, because, you know, yay. And once we get to Skull Dolphin, I'll chime back in. Here we go. We are riding a dragon. Woohoo! So, we're heading to Skull Dolphin, which the only way you can get there is by dragon. Um... And on the map, it doesn't even populate. Oh, okay. First time I've seen Shovely Joe this close up. I will look for your return. Or Alduin's. Yeah, thanks, man. Uh, let's remove this helmet real quick. Get a look at that glorious beard of his. Yeah, look at that. Shovely Joe looks like a true Nord. Well, all right. So we are going to end our episode here. If you guys haven't subscribed, make sure to do so and make sure to ring that bell. Also, make sure you check out the Discord. I've got a lot of stuff that I post in my Discord constantly. New videos, new shorts, updates. So make sure that you're checking all that out. And again, make sure to ring the bell.